beauty queens and yes I'm back with another video this video will be on this look here that you see here and basically what I wanted to do is film a video film a video that wasn't so um like I know a lot of the eyeshadows that I use are from the Lorac Pro palette and the chocolate bar palette from Too Faced and basically what I want to do is use a more affordable palette and this palette that I use today every all the shadows that I used on my eyes today came from this palette right here which is the BH Cosmetics 26 color palette neutral eyeshadows and some blush um that palette looks like this you guys seen me do this palette before and I just want to do it again because it is the holidays and being mothers I know a lot of times we don't have a lot of money left for ourselves because we're so busy spending money on other people and for our kids because that's our number one priorities and so um we kind of get what's left over after that and I think this BH Cosmetics palette is awesome and um me, I, I, the only thing about it today, I used a more um, expensive primer, and the primer that I used is the one I picked up last year. This time, when my mom gave me a um, gift gift card to stage, I got the Lid Smoothie um, Knick, and um, I like it. I just started back using it. I guess. I haven't been wearing makeup that long like I said this time last year so about the first of the year I started wearing makeup and I really didn't know how to use that correctly but now that I know more I mean of course I started back using it and so it really pulls those colors like a you know makes those colors very vibrant and it also gives them a, a you know long lasting they supposed to last longer but of course I don't wear my makeup too long that's another story but yeah i just want to do something very affordable and if you guys um watch me when i first started off like i said before when i first started off wearing makeup i don't know if you guys know or not but i never used a foundation and so um i've been breaking out on my jawline a little bit and to be honest with you guys i never had this problem before when i started wearing until i started wearing foundation with breakouts so in the video today i went back to my old routine and that's concealer only with the powder and i must say it looks very good and i may go back to this route i might just use concealer only and um foundation on special occasions and um yeah that's not liquid foundation on special occasions so yeah that's what i might be going back to because i don't know if it's my actual foundation or it's in my mac fix plus that's breaking me it's one of these two things like it or it could be something else but i, I just want to you know eliminate things that are not necessary so i don't think I need the foundation every day it looks fabulous I love foundation liquid foundation but I just want to get my skincare under control to keep you know good skin outside of when I don't want to wear makeup so what I did was I used my NC 45 on a couple spots that I had and also my NC 42 underneath um and MAC concealer and I think I'm just going to stick with those concealers for a little while and just dust some powder on top of that so yeah, I basically want to do something very affordable for all the mothers out there and all the ladies out there who always spend time buying stuff for other people and their kids and they motor, you know, and they want to just spruce up their look a little bit. So yeah, I, I I don't see anything wrong with this BH Cosmetics palette. To be honest with you, I feel like if you're for your everyday makeup use, you can get away with something like this. The only reason I have Lorac and Too Faced is because that's something I, you know, that's just something I want. It's not a necessity. So, yeah, your all your basic eyeshadows will come from this. My sister has the neutral palette, and they always have a sale going, BH Cosmetics. Of course, I have their link down below in the description box. And, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the look, and let me know what you want to see next. And until we meet the next time, big kisses. And also, you guys have a Merry Christmas and be blessed. Let's not forget this season. What this season is really for is really for family. And we're just thankful to be here with one another. And praises go up to the Lord, okay? So you guys have a blessed holiday season. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Mwah.